So there's a new pill out now called the pink pill. And I'm really getting sick of all the red pill, the, the green pill, the, the white pill, the blue pill, the, the black pill. It, it's all you pill motherfuckers is really starting to get on my nerves. And see, this is what happens when there's money in that business. Scammers and good talking ass niggas just come in and they just start saying anything that makes it sound real good and will sell you on all these courses and shit and you know y'all dumb people go buy it like fucking weirdos i mean but do what you want when you pop it you know what i'm saying do you think y'all ain't finna leave me out of it nigga i'm finna get some clout off this shit my damn self so if y'all want to be stupid and listen to all the EPL motherfuckers then let me react to this shit so there's only like a few people that know what they're talking about and it's literally a few the rest of it is is gimmicks and the reincarnation of steve wilco or jerry springers and you know it's just you know y'all just sit at the table with a round full of women and y'all just start arguing and talking over each other i don't know it's all starting to get annoying Women posting pictures of themselves is not the same thing as a man liking another girl's picture. Biologically, women have the desire to share, even if it's just a picture of themselves. When Kim Kardashian posts a picture of herself in a bikini, do you think that she's doing it so that guys will slide into her DMs? No. When she's going throughout her day, she's seeing herself in ways that she might not like. When she shares these pictures, she's crafting a narrative of her own image. For women, it's a reminder and a reflection of who we know we are at our best. This is... <laughs> That's an interesting take. I believe she takes pictures because you get paid off Instagram. Depending on how many interactions you got, you get paid off Instagram. Yo, everybody who's watching right now, I want y'all to imagine the worst thirst trap y'all had. You know what I'm talking about? You know, on Instagram, and it's a girl staring at the horizon, right? But like half the shot is just her ass. And she'd be like, how's my future looking? You know what I mean? Shit like that. You know what I mean? Okay, now I want y'all to picture. <laughs> I hate those captions. <laughs> it makes me want to uninstall Instagram every time, okay? That's facts. Okay, now I want y'all to picture that and I'm going to play this video back. And I yeah, want y'all to imagine that, okay? Let's just imagine this. Back. Posting pictures of themselves is not the same thing as a man liking another girl's picture. Biologically, women have the desire to share, even if it's just a picture of themselves. When Kim Kardashian posts a picture of herself in a bikini, do you think that she's doing it so that guys will slide into her DMs? No. When she's going throughout her day, she's seeing herself in ways that- All the women are not Kim Kardashian. When she- Yeah. I, I don't know about sliding into their DMs, but they're definitely thirst trapping. Uh, also, these girls get paid um, to do this shit. So, yeah. Post, she understand it's a business. Her posts sell. Yes. But to all the other women that don't have the following that Kim has and doesn't pull the money that Kim pull, which is most of the women that are on Instagram. And that's why I don't like the argument of where they go into celebrity shit. Why do your analogy has to go towards a celebrity you cannot compare yourself to a celebrity you have to compare yourself to a regular person or somebody near your status and are posting these kind of pictures it's not to be like yes i don't want people no it's the attend there's attention for there, there's attention you like attention you, you, come on now b all right no. When she's going throughout her day, she's seeing herself in ways that she might not like. When she shares these pictures, she's crafting a narrative of her own image. For women, it's a reminder and a reflection of who we know we are at our best. This is not the same thing as a man in a relationship liking pictures of random girls because he appreciates it. So, men in relationships shouldn't like other people's pictures, but women in relationships should post her straps. Is that what the narrative is? Is that what it is? Is that what I understand? Yes, because she's doing it to craft a narrative about her at her best. So you at your best is pushing on your hips so your ass looks like it's got the maximum amount of roundness, but it's really just your lower For her. back. For her. Extending into your ass, creating an optical illusion. But you at your best is you being as voluptuous as possible. Just shut the fuck up. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Just shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh my god. Hold on, let's Google this pink pill shit. It's, I will click on this. It says the very deep dive into the pink pill community, but just a two hour long shit. Uh, I ain't trying to click that. The pink pill course teaches women to be their very best selves, to learn how to navigate the world of elegance while dating in their daily life. Enroll in court. Well, I tell you, boy, all you motherfuckers got a course nowadays. Good God. 298, seven, the pink pill for business. The pink pill for college. The pink pill, what the? $797. Let, hold on, let's. At the pink pill, we don't just survive, we thrive. We don't buy into the limits others put upon us. We don't apologize for how we show up because when we show up, we are the distinction. I'm Crystalline Karazin, and I want to invite you to an exclusive circle of women who know pink is more than just a color. It's a way of life. Wow. Crystalline Karis. I, I could have swore I've heard that name before. She's on YouTube, isn't she? I think I remember O'Shea Duke Jackson talking about her. There's more? Oh my God. Damn. There is more. Jesus Christ. Yeah, that that's a good little presentation. This shit here is $997. $1,000. That shit is insane. $999. Yeah, I bet you she making some money because cause she on the front page. She is on the front page. This is a nice website too. This is a very nice website. Not only is she on the front page, she is on the, she is the very first thing you click. She definitely making money. Just shut the fuck up. Thank you. It's okay. Post your pictures, get the attention. Maybe you're feeling yourself in the outfit. It's okay to say you're getting some validation. You feel kind of nice. People leave the little likes and comments. We get the little dopamine rush. We all know what it is. But guys who are liking it, because it look nice and you like it. Okay, so what, they sh what should they do? Shut the fuck up. If someone genuinely feels good about themselves, they never have a need in the first place to be validated online by strangers. But see, you don't get it. This is also a business. These girls make money, a lot of fucking money. I used to know a girl that I work with. She was borderline cute, literally borderline cute. You will never know who this girl is. And trust me when I say that this girl would have dude sending her money just for just for her to send them feet pics. She was borderline cute. Now imagine somebody that looks really fucking good with a lot of followers. Imagine what type of with them girls having their cash app in the in the bio. Imagine what they make. Jesus. I know they just pulling in all the dough. As a woman, she lying through her teeth. Women all know exactly what they doing. <laughs> I love that shit. Yeah, these comments mm -hmm. are wild. Okay, she replied to somebody. She got oh. mad. Oh, what'd she say? She says she's doing it to remind herself who she is at her best for the times when she's not feeling that way. No, that's no. Nah. If her man doesn't feel. No. Nah. Wait, no, nah, I know. That, does that make y'all Wait, wait, feel hold on. If her man doesn't feel comfortable with her doing, how the hell did this go right to a man? Like, that was a damn curveball. How did you do that? You need a man to make you feel good about yourself? Then you're miserable. Nah. Wait, nah, I know. That, does that make y'all feel better when you guys don't feel sexy? You guys go through some of your old pictures and make you feel better? Nah. I feel like it has to have the opposite effect. Nah. Yeah. Nah, feel, oh, nah. yeah. That's, that's. It, it's, it reminds you what you used to look like. That, that, that that's what it do. And it reminds you, oh, man, I should be right here and I need to get back here knowing that you will never get back there. Reality. Some of you will get back there. But a lot of you will not get back to the weight you used to have. So keep looking at them pictures and keep thinking to yourself, damn, I used to look like this, but now I look like this. I just thought I'd react to this just to see what he had to say about this pink pill shit. And I didn't even know there was a, a full on course, $900 course on the shit. Well, let's, let's just see another one. 
as a comment if her man doesn't feel comfortable with her doing it that's oh, one yes. thing okay. but it's not the equivalent of a man disrespecting his woman by liking another woman's picture nah you're crazy you're bugging my girl shut this shit off she's bugging bye no 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 so see no you're really I trying to give yourself a reason let me let me ask a question if it's just about her having reflections of herself that are the best why she gotta post it keep your fucking reflections in your little photo yeah. album so you can scroll through it no you need yeah, the interaction. Yeah, yeah. You, need, you the need the reaction. You need the people leaving the comments and the likes, which is fine. Do that, but don't pretend like someone's. And you need the money. They get paid. You know they got a subscription button now on Instagram. You, the cash app. You can put your link tree in there, and you know it, it'll just send you all your links. And you know, as a website, you get paid for the interactions as well. So there's that. Cause you can just take pictures and keep you it on your it, phone. You got it on your phone. Stop. If it make you feel so good to be like, oh, 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 I look good, five pop life. If it make, just keep it on. But you gotta broadcast it. No, you lying. You flame it. You lying through your teeth. Stop it. I just wanted to get their reaction. I'm gonna catch y'all in the next video.